That nigga say job. So you heard me say job. So through all that shit right there, right? Right. And I know how that penitentiary shit go, right? So did anybody ever approach you about paying protection? So you won't have to keep taking the man's whoop. Protection? Yeah. Man, let me <laughs> protection. That mean I had to pay everybody that was on that fucking line if I had to pay for protection. Because look like every piece of nigga on that line wanted a piece of peewee. You know what I'm saying? People was getting his ass whooped. But a lot of people think, don't know, if I was getting my ass whooped, it's because of shit I didn't know, you know? Like, not knowing how to two for one credit shit, not knowing if I bump into a motherfucker, he gonna retaliate for no reason. You know, I, protection shit, fuck, <laughs> protection. I'm still looking for it now. Ain't no protection in that picture. <laughs> protection. The guards right. supposed to do that. <laughs> shit, ain't no protection. Well, I, I got, I got to ask you this, Pee Wee. I, I gotta, I gotta ask you this. Hold on. You say protection. Shit. Yeah, protection. All right, it, it go my question. So, couldn't pay for protection. Everybody getting on your ass, right? Right. It, this, this is what we want to know because I done did eight years. Hollywood did twenty five years, right? And we did it in Texas. You in Louisiana, right? When you go to prison, Pee Wee, you lost 180 some fights. This, this is what I know in Texas. In Texas, when you when you fighting, you fighting for your ass. Do you understand what I'm saying? Basically, like these, yeah. these niggas is goddamn me booty bandits and and and, and um they here to take advantage of niggas all right. the way around the board, right? right. So if, so if you come in there slipping and sliding and getting your ass towed up. At some point, you're gonna have to put a a, a a a goddamn bandage on your asshole, right? So I got a question. Niggas did all that fighting. How did you keep niggas from penetrating you, Pete? We help us out. All right. See, let's go here. <laughs> See, I was we was in a prison, but a lot of these dudes, you know, like coming from the streets, and I was coming from the streets, and I'm saying a lot of that shit wasn't going on over there in that prison like that. See, a lot of that shit was happening like at Angola, you know? A lot of them boys that, you know, are they come that gate, you know what I'm saying? Are they already fucked up? But it never was to the point where a nigga tried to, you know, like that, you know? I mean, it was like the fights, I ain't gonna tell you no lie. At a point upon a time, I fell asleep and I thought that I was gonna lose my shit like that because of the ad, real shit. You know, and I'm not trying to be funny or not because you never know what to expect in that right. shit because of the shit that you see. But a lot of people don't know. A lot of people really put themselves in a situation to be penetrated or tampered with. You know what I'm saying? Right. You know, people be fucked. And there was always time I ain't never put my hands down and then put sense and put them up. But I fucked. You understand what I'm saying? Right. But they really wasn't into that shit over here. You know? Right. You know? It's like it's hard to explain, but yeah, I, I felt like that many times. Shit, I thought, and be honest, shit, yeah, man, I keep telling you, I'm the nigga got his ass whooped so bad, called home to his old lady that was cheating on him. So yeah, they got different types of ass whoopers in that bitch, and they got some of make you just say fuck it, and you know what I'm saying? 